my channel. It's like 11.30 now and I got up at 8.30 this morning and I just decided to take some me time. As weird and lame as that might sound, I've just been really focusing on being happy lately and I feel like when I focus on myself and myself being happy, I exude that and my vibe is sort of contagious with other people. So if I'm happy, I feel like other people around me are happy as well. So this morning I just focused on myself. I made that green smoothie that you saw, which has been my favorite breakfast lately. So I made that and I sat outside in the sun and I read this new book that I got. So I sat there with my highlighter and I highlighted all my favorite parts of the book and it was really nice. I've got to go to uni in like an hour and I'm only at uni for an hour, which is fine. Also, I don't know if you noticed the scale this morning, but it said 114 pounds. Not that I go off weight because muscle weighs more than fat and blah, 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 but I've never been 114 pounds. Well, I haven't been 114 pounds in ages. I was at 117 pounds for a long time. I just sort of stayed like that and my body wouldn't change. And then I changed my diet a little bit and I bumped up to 121 pounds and I felt like really full of water and I wasn't lean and I just wasn't very happy. And then all these diet changes I've made in two weeks, I dropped from like 118 pounds down to 114 pounds. So I'm still sticking to those diet changes that I've made. If you want to know all about those diet changes, click this link up here if you're on a desktop because my previous video I talked about my diet secrets and what I've changed in my diet to get to where I am now. So I'm so stoked. I feel like my body's progressing really well. I'm fuller than normal, like I'm actually full for once. My sweet tooth has decreased like crazy. I feel really happy and I feel really content with life and I'm just in a really positive mindset and I hope that reflects onto you guys too so when you watch my videos you leave it being positive as well. So here with <laughs> Tegan, we, when do we start uni? We've got to leave in like half an hour. I'm not fit like running fit, I can't do cardio, you know this. So we've got half an hour till uni and it's such a beautiful day so we thought we would go for a walk yes. and then get depressed when we're at uni. So this is like the happy part of our day. <laughs> We got a coffee to celebrate. We we're only here for an hour. So this is gonna be like my pre-workout. I just got my usual. Tegan ordered it for me. What do I get? Uh, a large long black with a dash of almond. Make sure it's at the top. I always get a large coffee and I open it up and it's filled halfway. If I wanted a halfway coffee, I would order a small, not a large. Okay, I'm just getting what I paid for. You're really close to that thing. Tegan can't drive. Okay, four o'clock and I'm off to the gym. I've got my BCAs from Prana, just the pomegranate flavor. And I know I said I was gonna do an ab workout, but I have a bad feeling that when I get to the gym, it's gonna be really packed, which doesn't really um, encourage me to film because I feel like a loser. I really need to do either abs or an upper body session because I'm notorious for doing legs. I love doing legs. Today, I gotta bite the bullet and do upper body. Is my yoga mat in the car? Yes, my yoga mat is here. I'm gonna practice some yoga as well.
gone out at six o'clock and I didn't really have the best workout and I think it's because I forgot to have a pre-workout meal. So lately I've been having breakfast, lunch, a pre-workout snack and then dinner and that's been working really really well for me and I was at the gym and I was so hungry and I had no energy so whatever I just listened to my body so I did a little bit of ab stuff and then some push-ups and now I'm going and I'm gonna go buy paint for my room and go and check out some beds because I'm getting a queen bed for my new room Woo! so excited so I'm gonna do that as quick as I can because I'm starving and I want to go home and make some dinner this has been one of my favorite dinners lately I'm really relying on barramundi as my favorite source of protein and then a huge salad like I said I'm sort of steering away from sauteed vegetables and relying on salads so this is just a whole bunch of different vegetables in my salad. It's seasoned with some olive oil, salt and pepper and jalapenos and the jalapeno sauce from the jar. And then two pieces of barramundi because one does not fill me up. That is going to conclude the vlog. Sorry that it was so short. I just was really busy that day and couldn't really film. In my next vlog, I am showing you a big body update because I'm getting ready for a photo shoot. So look forward to that. But yeah, this was just like a normal day in the life, what I eat in a day, pretty basic. I'm pretty much eating the same thing, but it's because it's working for me. So don't fix what's not broken, right? Anyway, I will see you in my next vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a like and subscribe to my channel because I put out new videos every single week. I will see you in my next vlog. Bye.